Let's get into the conversation because I've got the adults in the room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, do I do that to you? <laughs> Every time I listen to you guys when I'm leaving, you're always very proper. And uh, I imagine the Duchess with a teacup with a gold rim on it. No, and oh, and, and, and uh, Emmanuel is, is, is dapper. You know, he's got uh, his um, pocket square, he's got a cravat. And um, Eric, Eric is just, you know, he's got a top hat and he doesn't look at people. <laughs> I think we need to dress We're up all beneath room. him. Guys, we need to dress We're up all beneath time. him. <laughs> and oh, I'm just a girl in jeans. <laughs> oh, my God. I love, 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 love adults in the room. And you can get to check them out. Maybe some of these things I'm saying are true. www.spicefan.co.ke One of the questions that I have today um, is uh, business and friendship. Would you do business with a friend? And you started off as friends, and then you decide to get into business together. Do you think that's a good idea, especially for women? I actually do that, and it's running quite well, so I would advocate for it. Is it? Yes, I've been running business with my friends for about five years. Wow. Yes, and we've even opened a second business earlier this year. Is she from Ikolomani? No. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> They're all not from Ikolomani. They're from the one is from Meru. Yeah. There are two are from one is West, Western, and the other one is from Meru. We have a barn restaurant. Wow, and it's pure trust. We, I'm here. They run Bookkeeping, it. everything. We have to. Wow, you got good friends. Let's yeah. do tea sometime. We should. <laughs> what about you? Yeah, we run other businesses for the last four years. So we actually are wow. growing together. It's possible, but it, it requires a lot of discipline. Mm. And of course, we fall off the wagon once mm. in a while, but we get back on it. And, 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 and you know, uh, you've got that experience of four years. Yes. So you can speak on it. Yes, and we know where we can get it. We know each other's homes, even the village. So, <laughs> so the background <laughs> check is important. What yes. about you? I think you should do for, uh, business with friends mm. and add another friend called a lawyer. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Just to facilitate that friendship. Friendship. Because we are friends, mm. uh, this lawyer won't affect our friendship. Yeah, so it's sure. more like, listen, you better get that money, yeah, right? Friends, yes. you know? yeah. so even He's if, right uh, about that. Even if, even if they know uh, my place in Ikolomani, for instance, yes. uh, the lawyer will help out. He doesn't you know, even care where you're from. Yes. Yeah. He's like, we need the legalities in place. Yes. Mm -hmm. We're not friends at this time. We're mm -hmm. business partners. Yes. yes. We can take the friendship outside. Yep. True. Yep. So you have that discipline. Yeah, we have that. Mm. We have a lawyer. And we have everything legal documents. Wow, you sound very serious. Uh, yeah, no, no, like listening. you're like she listening right now. <laughs> no, no, it's a business. It's a business. I because like we're that. not only doing it for us, we're doing it for our children, our future generations. So if it messes up, if I drop that today, they know anything, any shares I have that. So meaning the daughter. business is not a friendship. No, we started it from friendships. Mm. Yeah. But you brought up an in interesting point, which means you share the same values. Yes. You see, maybe you're doing it for your kids and yeah. they're doing it just as a part time hustle. Yeah. And, you know, for whatever, just whatever. And I think if you share common values, what, what you're doing it for, you've got foresight, you know, you, you look at things in, in the same way. I think mm. you can, you know, it's, it's aligned. Yeah. But sometimes you can find two people that are very different. Like why I'm doing it and why you're doing it is very different. Yeah. Does it matter? I think I would rather lean towards uh, inculcating a business arrangement and yes. then our friendship follows than in the state of uh, I agree. friends doing business. Mm. Mm. Let's start off with the business, do our thing, and then if we become friends while well, we're at it, that's, mm. that's good. Yeah. But All what right. if you're friends and now you want to start a business? In short, you can't start a business with Eric. You're already friends. Eric is saying we, that you can't. That, that, that no, ship has sailed. Him, so that so. ship has sailed. If oh. you were friends first... No, I mean, I think, do you, do you mean that, Eric? You no, understand what I'm saying? Are you trying to defend <laughs> yourself? <laughs> if, if I was given a choice to do business with a friend or do business, then become friends, I would rather the latter than yeah. the former. Yes. Um, All right. And we also had one quick one um, on the show. It's a new segment, and this is where I get my DMs hit. It was a tornado today, mm -hmm. and uh, it was all about a guy who had to sacrifice between his marriage and uh, his job because his job, uh, his employer is now the sister-in-law who wants other things. Um, he wants to have him as a snack bar. Alternative, alternate, alternate services. Yes, um, more like the um, post. Has he tested work? the goods? <laughs> <laughs> well, Barbara. No, no, it's a good question. If he has tested, then why? He already enjoyed it. He's just looking for. He's just looking for a guilt trip. Mm. If he's tasted it, has he tasted it? But <laughs> there are no buts. It's either he has or has it. What about what, what about um, you know leaving the job? He can and, leave and, the job, but he's already made a mistake. He tasted the goods. Look from the buts you're saying. Mm -mm, honey. Did he say, nothing. Uh, did he say he did anything with the lady? First of all, just the fact that she is pushing and pushing and pushing, and the fact that he did not quickly say, "I'm out of this." He said, I don't want to lose my job. 
Yeah. That think, bothered me. I that think, bothered me I so think much. I'd, uh, I'm not a counselor, but I tell that brother that there, there are many opportunities out there. Mm. So even if you lose a job, you know, like don't worry so much about the job. There's something will open up. Yeah. Like uh, losing the job is not the worst that it could get. Yeah, but know? losing your wife yes. and jeopardizing your family, yes, that's yes. a thing. Yeah, yeah. Hit my DM. I will be having uh, another fantastic show tomorrow, 3 p.m. to 7 p.m. Okay, not to fear. I will not say your name. Hit the DM. <laughs> and of course, Kesha will have another fantastic show right here on the Spice Drive. Adults in the room are going to take it, and I'm sure, I'm sure you're in very, very good and able hands. Keep it right here, and uh, this is your uh, favorite station, Spice FM, www.spicefm.co.ke.